treating anxiety disorders, which mean phobia, generalized anxiety disorders, and obsessive compulsive disorders with virtual reality and with a C2K environment is, f is feasible and efficient. Why efficient? Why, why clinically efficient? Because it was proven in uh, clinical trials and studies published in scientific papers that you can find on internet and all of these papers, all of these studies have demonstrated using a number, a different number of patients having anxiety disorder that indeed virtual reality was efficient which means that the patient was more happy, was less stressed, less anxious and that they can uh, find again their freedom to take the plane to go outside, uh, take the lift, uh, uh, walking outside without being afraid of animals, etc. So for treating anxiety disorders, how many sessions do you need uh, by using virtual environment from C2 care? Um, in fact, when we treat anxiety disorders, so phobia, obsession, uh, generalized anxiety disorder, we will use four to five sessions entirely dedicated to uh, cognitive therapy. So you will spend four to five sessions without virtual reality to teach your patient the techniques, the method to deal with their emotions. So cognitive therapy, relaxation, etc. And then after the four, these four or five sessions, you will use 8 to 10 sessions or 6 to 10 sessions, depends, by using virtual reality for this session. So all in all, all together, you will need 10 to 12, 14 uh, sessions. So for the beginning, 4 5 for um, teaching the method and 8 to 10 by exposing to virtual reality. This is the same protocol that we see in clinical trials. So treating anxiety disorders using virtual reality, is it proven that it's efficient? So the question is, is important and yes, because as the first uh, published uh, clinical studies have taken place in the 90s, so in 1992, 1993, it means that we are already more than 25 years of published articles and clinical trials who have proven that indeed virtual reality exposure therapy is efficient to treat anxiety disorders. Efficient means that the patient feels better, is happier, and of course is far less stressed, far less anxious in the plane, in the train, in the subway, uh, uh, regarding, regarding uh, um, dirty objects, uh, regarding general stress, and that he have found what he was seeking, which is his freedom, his or her liberty. So how does the patient react when he will first use with you uh, the virtual environment made by C2Care or virtual environment in general. Uh, the first session will always be very impressive for them because they will, they will try to anticipate and will be a bit stressed because it's still, still unknown to them, especially if they have never used a headset. Um, but, it's, but after they have tried, after they have listened to your voice and they have tried and they see that it's, it's not completely real, which is good because it gives them the, the courage uh, to go forward in the, the, in the therapeutic virtual environment. Uh, so it just needs one session or maybe five, ten minutes of practice in a not too anxious environment and after it will become natural. So it's quite easy. Everybody f from teenagers to older people uh, can easily uh, use virtual reality. The question that many professionals ask us is, is it easy to use the computer and use the software of C2Care and to deal with it during uh, the treatment? Uh, yes, because it's, it's very, very accessible and very, very easy. Why? Because we know that there is different kind of familiarity 
of a professional regarding the, uh, the computer equipment and the virtual reality equipment. So the virtual environment have been made to be really easy, just one click with your mouse to turn on the software and one or two clicks with your mouse to choose the environment, the plane, the dog, the street, the, the subway, to start the treatment in virtual reality. So yes, it's very easy, very accessible in a minute. If you are a professional and you, you don't know how to use virtual reality in your clinical practice, uh, there is recommendation and guidelines uh, uh, provided with the virtual environment that you can find. You can also find on the website of C2Care, uh, you can find some video tutorial. And uh, aside from this, uh, uh, my colleagues and myself are organizing uh, formation uh, in order to, uh, to teach professional uh, doctors and psychotherapists how to use, uh, in just a day, how to use the, the virtual environments of C2Care uh, in their clinical practice.